What up? I said, what up? What's going on, y'all? Chilling, chilling, chilling. So I just watched the Call of Duty Black Ops 3 trailer of, you know, the, the not gameplay trailer, but it's the, the campaign trailer. And wow, it really looks great. The graphics look crazy. The PS4 graphics. Oh my goodness. But I really wanted to talk about why do the campaign always look better than multiplayer? And look at me. Ah, I just made it. I think, and it's blasphemy right now because I don't have any gameplay audio. I hate commentaries without gameplay audio. I, oh my goodness, it's fucking bad. I hate it. I like to hear the gun sounds and all that stuff. But back to what I was saying. I think that the campaign's graphics always look better because the renderer in the engine doesn't have to think as much. You know, like like in multiplayer, it doesn't control the movements of the player. Like it doesn't know where, like in, in, in the campaign, it knows if a soldier is going to go left, right, you know, an enemy, up, down, jump, Man, bring some music or something in here. Oh my goodness. But that, that's my thought. I, I, it's too many, you know, random movements in multiplayer. And in the campaign, I think that it has like scripted movements. So that's why they can focus on the graphics and all that. Drop the motherfucking beat. Uh. Uh huh. It's like, no, y'all thought I was gonna kick a freestyle or something. But tell me what y'all think. Um, I know it's, I know all of my chat knows everything. I'm doing the quote fingers. So tell me what y'all think. Why does multiplayer look worse than the campaign on every game except like the regular Nintendo or whatever? But like I was saying before, thanks for all the support. I will be back in full force. I still didn't get NBA 2K yet. I might get it this weekend when I, or I, I'm off Mondays and Tuesdays. So I might get it like Monday or something when I get some time because when I get home, I be trying to rest or get some pussy or something like that. And I don't live near, I live by a GameStop. It's not that far, but like it's kind of out my way. You know, I just want to go straight home when I get off work. <laughs> so I'm back at work now and uh, it's okay. You know, if y'all didn't know, I took like two weeks off chilling, chilling, chilling. I didn't even fly anywhere. I usually fly to like Miami when I take a couple days off. Miami's like my second home because that's, that's where I always go. San Juan is starting to be like well, my third home because I really like San Juan. The waters are nice and clear. I don't know how I started talking about San Juan in Miami, but yeah. Um, games that I'm looking forward to. I really want to check out the Battlefront beta because I'm really on edge of buying that game. Betas are really a blessing. If you if the if if a um, developer wants to bring out a beta, I think that's really a blessing. I think it's confidence, you know. I think it's confidence that the game is gonna sell because White Boy, oh my goodness, he's under some like a gag order or some shit. Pause. He can't really talk, but he told me I'm gonna say it. He told me he fucking love the game. Like he said that shit like feels like crazy like you know like fun you know shitting on people there i go that's me jive turkey he said it's fun he said the movements feel good battlefield fans he said the movements feel like battlefield with the freedom of call of duty so if you go from 
Battlefield, he didn't say it in those words, but that's basically what he was saying. If you go from Battlefield to COD and, and you feel a little weird for like the first couple minutes, you most likely you will like um uh, uh, Battlefront. So I'm gonna try it out. I was on edge. If they make it too kiddy and childish and too easy to do everything, I'm probably not gonna pick it up. That's why they got a beta. And that's all. Um, I think the campaign looks good in um, Black Ops 3. Um, <laughs> Y'all know me. I don't look at look at this guy rejacking, rejacking. Y'all know me. I don't play any campaigns or anything. So don't look forward to a walkthrough or anything like that. But I'm out of here, y'all. Jive Turkey. Yo, this your boy Jive Turkey live from the two. One, madre, maldito, cinco. And remember, Michael Jordan is the jive turkey of basketball. I'm out.